Good morning. It's Glover International, and this is Solar Bear Challenge number nine. R for reveal. It is Friday the 13th, and it's about 25 degrees. My hope is to show you three little known or forgotten places, and one of them is right there. To the older locals, or those who may care to find out, this building is called the Old Woolen Mill, and it was the factory that was Hardwick Clothes. Hardwick Clothes has the distinction of being the oldest maker of tailored clothing in the United States. Uh, but the, the word was here that raw wool would go out one end of the building and beautiful finished clothing would go out the other. So from the wool's back to the clothing rack is what they used to say. And during World War II, many a military uniform was made right here. To my right is the Bradley County Courthouse. And to my left is the Bank of Cleveland. And it's been several things lately. I'm not sure that it's anything right now. But in the past, uh, it was a different building, and that different building had uh, many different businesses and things in it. Uh, but at one time, it was called the Okoye Inn, and the Okoye Inn even was many different things. But one thing that it was, was a hospital that served soldiers of the Civil War. I'm directly in front of the Bradley County Courthouse. And that's where I'm going to do my walk around. Here we go. Solar bear, solar bear, solar bear, solar bear, solar bear, solar bear. That's one. Solar bear, solar bear, solar bear, solar bear, solar bear, solar bear. That's two. Solar bear, solar bear, solar bear, solar bear, solar bear, solar bear. And that's three. That's my last walk around of the season. But I've got one more thing I need to show y'all. I'm in a very prominent neighborhood. I'm sure some of these are easily seven figure homes. But right here in the middle of this neighborhood, there is something that very, very few people probably know. And if you look just to the right of that white Honda over there, you might be able to see the house where I did some of my growing up through those trees. I understand that every bit of this was just forest. None of these houses were here 35 years ago when I was nine years old. I was out here with my brother and we took a little hike. Now I suppose it would be possible for someone to walk right through here and never even see what they were walking through. But this is the Eldridge and Keebler Family Cemetery. There are a few stones dotted through over there. This is the most prominent one, the one that I remember seeing with my brother when I was nine years old. Some of them date back to the 1850s. That's the oldest one that I've found today. It's to 1852. So there you go, solar bears. It's been a wonderful solar bear season. And thank you so much to 08 for hosting for us. And uh, to all of my co-competitors, good luck. May the odds be forever in your favor. Hey. All right, we're cool. He sees you. Yeah, but it's Friday the 13th, man. <laughs>